All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to quickly calibrate your Mega Live 2 sonar. It's really simple. It's gonna set your transducer up to be um, sort of at its optimal settings within the head of the transducer, and then you can still change everything from there. It's not something you have to do every time you hit the water or anything like that, and you can also toggle it on and off. So here we go. Go up to these lines. Then you're gonna go to settings down here. Go to installation. Calibrate Mega Live 2 sonar. Um, just a couple things. You're gonna wanna have your Mega Live in forward mode, obviously be in the water. And then you wanna try to find a, a flat bottom with no fish, bait, or cover. That's about impossible to do here in Michigan right now, so we got some bait fish down there. Otherwise, it's pretty flat. But uh, And then try to do it in the morning when it's as calm as possible. We're here kind of in the middle of the day. It's not ideal, but we're just showing you guys how it's done. And then turn off all your other sonar. So we're going to start our calibration here. We're in 21 feet. You want to be anywhere from 15 to 25 feet deep. And here we go. Just takes a minute or two. I'm not going to make you guys sit through it, but it will prompt you and say calibration is done. And after that, you're good to go.